Det börjar bli dags för nästa talare. Om alla skulle vilja slå sig ner. Our next speaker is uh, Guillaume Fay. He earned his uh, doctorate in political science from Paris Institute of Political Studies and went on to become one of the principal members of the famous metapolitical organization GRES in France during the 70s and 80s, which was the group that first introduced the school of thought of what came to be called the New Right. After departing GRES in 1986 due to his disagreement with its strategy, he had a success, successful career on French television and radio before returning to the stage of political philosophy. As a powerful alternative voice with the publication of RQ Futurism in 1998, which presented the idea of a new Europe stretching from Ireland to Siberia and based upon the synthesis of radical technology with ancient virtues and traditional European values. Since then, he has continued to challenge the status quo of the right in his writings, earning him both admiration and controversy. I welcome up to the stage, Guillaume Fay. Swedish, I don't know. <laughs> Madame Merkel, Frau Merkel, I call them Turkel. She knows Turkish. <laughs> Erdogan, Erdogan, Erdogan. This is not an immigration. Since the year 70, it began during the year 70, not now. The problems of the migrant now, it's stupid. It began in the year 70. It's like a cancer. The cancer has begun 10 years ago, and now it continues, always, always, and always. Since the year 70, this is an acceleration of the immigration. Is it not immigration? Not immigration. It's a question of uh, semantic, of word. This invasion. It is the most important event since the Neolithic era changing of population in the European populations, changing global populations. Ethnocide, 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 changing of population, obvious, obvious. All the oligarchy Europeans say, fantastic. New populations, fantastic. No, it's horrible. It's a demise that I can have two days to speak to you about this. But I hope that you will read my books about this. Because I say this always. I have here some, uh, I have here, you know, some uh, numbers, especially for Sweden. Sweden is a country of 9 million of inhabitants. And you have in danger of disparation in two generations. 
because you have one million this year, one million immigrants here in Sweden, with a, nat with a native population rate, immigration, uh, population rate, very, very bad, very, how do you say in English? Low, low, yeah, low, it's not very bad. Uh, you know, and um, which is very interesting, that in this uh, invasion, it is the first time of all the history of Europe, this invasion is not military, it is organized by our elites, by our oligarchy, by a sort of ethnomadochism. Terrible in no matter Collaboration. Collaborationism with Islam and with invasions. They organized the political class of all Europe, even in America, organized the invasion for the first time. We are not attacked by a military attack by the others to be invaded. But our, our elites, our political class, say to them, we open, we open the arms, we open the doors. Come, please, come, please, come, please. Is it the first time of the history? No, it is in the second times. In the fourth century, the Roman Empire, except the Goths, the Goths, the Goths, pursued by the Huns, but the Goths were white people, the Goths were Indo-Europeans, it was different. For the first time, we have in Europe today a phenomenon incredibly that we never saw in history. In all the times, we have, for the first time, population with elite accepting their own invasion. It is, I say in my books, ethno-masochisme. Ethno-masochisme. Masochisme. End de soi, end de soi-même. You hate yourself, you hate your people. And xenophilia, Greek xenophilia, the, I love the strangers. Come, 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 please, invade me. Rape me, please, rape me, please. And this is a mental illness. Is it the first time in history that's, that it occurred? Further, we shall say how to fight against this. We are we, we are we, Kisamdu, we are we. We are brothers, we are brothers. Sweden, French, English, Russians, white Americans, we are brothers. We are members of the same people. We are the same people. Our state nation was very important in the 21th century. It was important in the 20th or 19th century. Now, we must make, and as Nietzsche said, Umwertung. Umwertung in German, it means changing mentality. We must change mentality. We must pass from the mentality, geopolitical or national, to a mentality, I called it geopolitical, no. Ethno-political, ethno-political. We are people on the same roots. We are Sweden, we are French, we are Italian, we are Switzerland, we are Russian. In the world future, we will be brothers. This is very important. We must overpass the level of the nation state. This is a revolution. This is a revolution. From geopolitical to ethnopolitical. I discussed about this with members of the government of a certain Mr. Putin in the Kremlin. And they said to me, you are not, perhaps are you right? I write in some of my books that uh, the future concept will be the concept of uh, Euro Siberia and no Euro Russia. Euro Siberia. <laughs> Last week I was in Washington in the NPI Congress and I said that to my friends Americans. 
And, I, and, and you know, we discussed and they said, perhaps it will be interesting in the future to have an alliance with North America, Europe, and Russia. It is perhaps Euro-Siberia or more than Euro-Siberia, according to the old Greek terms, Septentrion, the North. All the people of the North, plus Australia, New Zealand, but this is Ireland, you know, not in Poland. I have prepared uh, the chiffres, the chiffres, comme on dit en anglais, je ne sais plus, numbers. You know that uh, three million people are now attending to go in Europe, in Turkey, and that Air Merkel, still standing with Mr. Erdogan, said, yes, we pay you three million dollars, three million euro, to stop the immigration in Europe. And Mr. Erdogan said, no. By reverse, we want to visa for all the Turkish in Europe. Yes? And we want to go in the European community. We want to go immediately. So the two person, the two people, the most, I must say in my blog, the most dangerous for we European people are Mrs. Merkel and Mr. Erdogan, the new, the new uh, sultan. Two, pe two people very, very dangerous for the invasion of Europe. Don't forget that Turkey want to invade Europe Turkey one to invade Europe, which is natality. The second problem is that we European, we have not children. This is our problem. When you have no children in two generations, you have destroyed. Of course, it's mathematic. Don't forget that, of course, demography is the only real science. Demography is a children not born, is not born, you know. In economic, you can in economy you can. You can say what you want in demography, no. We are today two millions, two millions migrants. Today, it's an increasing thing, incredible, in Europe. And you, in Sweden, you are treated more than the others because you are only nine millions of people and you must accept every year from here about 200,000 each year. If nothing changes, Sweden will disappear genetically, genetically, genetically in one generation. We are we. We are we. Members of the European old community, ethnic and cultural. We are to be proud we have to be proud to be ourselves. We do not insult the others. We are racist to be ourselves. We are the only. If I go identity for the blacks and the Arabs, and form it up. Sensational, merci, bravo. But if I say we have some proud to be the French, you know, I'm proud to be a member of the white French community. Sin, péché, racist, racist. It is an invention, it is a problem of a ethnomasochist, it is a problem of a, you know, mental disorder, heal mental disorder in the Europeans. Page 2. Look, I, I don't know, uh, you know, I, 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 have a, I have a great number, but you know, the time is up. Uh, for example, in France, you know, you have six, uh, between six and eight millions of Muslims, and each Friday, more number of people, there is more people in Friday going in the mosque, mosque, I don't know if you say that in English, mosque, mosque, no? than uh, Catholics or Protestants going in the churches, you know. You know, in France, in France, today, 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 today. Terrible. No, it's like that. But we must fight. It is, uh, at the large sense, a uh, mental illness of the European. Uh, in France, you know, you have two problems. Those who are the four, we have four immigrations, are the Catholic hierarchy, the Pope, for example. 
and all the bishops in France, they, you know, they find the popes. The popes come in Lampedusa, benvenuti, benvenuti a nostra amici, no, dell'Islam, veni, 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 prego, veni. Then the pope said in Italian to the, we are very happy to, to open our, 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 to open our doors, to open our arms to you. Uh, you Muslims came, invade you, please, invade you, please, invade us, please, invade us, please, you know. And, uh, you know, uh, uh, same problem with the Jewish intellectual in France. Half of them are uh, rightists now, and half of them are not rightists, because they was for immigration. I saw uh, my friend, Professor Kevin McDonald, I met in Washington last week. Uh, they were for immigration, you know, and now they uh, realize that each week in France, you know, and all uh, the way, you have one Jew killed by Muslims, you know, uh, because of the problems between them, between Islam and so. So my uh, near book, uh, <coughs> Comprendre l'Islam, which is being translated by Arthos in some, in some year, in some, uh, No, no, c'est pas grave. Ça va? Ça va. Ça s'arrange. Ça s'arrange. Pourquoi pas tout de suite? Ah, thank you. Professor, now I speak of the oh, civil war in France. It is serious. Professor André Osset, which is a specialist and good observer of French society and the London University, published a book two weeks ago, Insurrection in France. Each week in France, you have, shh, media doesn't call. Insurrections, car, in birds, you know, murders and so. Nobody speaks about this. More than in England, in which he predicts a civil ethnic war in France. Within 10 years, he wrote, I am fascinated by the ethnic violence that feel in France. The same observation can be made by other countries of Western Europe. The causes are always the same, in vision. At each time, mixing of population gives wars, gives civil wars. I think that in 10 years, we shall have a civil ethnic wars in France. A recent inquiry of the 20th of 6 October in the daily French Le Figaro pointed out that the global ethnic revolt is in preparation up to explode in France. Bad news? No, good news. The war is the best way to solve the problems. Truth needs war. And war, truth needs. According to me, my country will be in Europe the laboratory of the new form of war. Dans l'histoire de l'humanité, les guerres changent tout le temps forme. In the history of a human being, wars are always changing. We must are preparing to a future war. It's sure, here it's a very sympathetic assembly. Well, peace, peace, but don't they will be always in peace. For example, today we are in peace because in the supermarket, the caddies are full, but when the caddy will be empty, Vide. At this time, things will be changed. You know. For example, we are, we are living, I think, we Europeans, in the end of autumn. Autumn, autumn. You say autumn, autumn in English? Autumn? Autumn, autumn. I'm sorry? Autumn, autumn, la fin de l'automne. Les derniers beaux jours, the last good days, and after will come the war. But the war of certain chance, no? We shall win. And I saw tout à l'heure pourquoi nous allons vaincre. We Europeans, we Europeans, we are victims of two things terrible ethnomasochisme. Masochisme vis-à-vis -vis de soi-même. Mas masochisme, you know, ethno-masochisme, masochisme. Ah, I hate myself. And xenophilie, it's a word Greek. Xenophilie, I love the others, you know. Xenophilie. 
love of the others, of the strangers. This is very strange links between, I, I wrote in English, this you know, it's a, it's a good, good English. Uh, three links between these phenomena that are suspect to be closely associated in the same pathological symptom, the hate of oneself, the hate of in old people and nation, ethnomasochism and xenophilia. This mental illness is very widespread among the oligarchy. We build laws and we manage the media and the public opinions in the Western countries. These three phenomena are, and now I explain to you the three phenomena against the European roots, three mental phenomena, according to me, according to me, according to me, not the universality, according to me. Three phenomena very links, genetically links, genetically links. No. Immigrationism, yes, of course, of course. In the, in, the sta in the station of Munich, you know, you say the Germans, come, come, invade us, please, 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 please. Come, come, go. I can see on the film. Immigrationism. Abo no, 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 In interesting. Abortion, no. I am not, no, 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 I am not like, of course, Mr. Erdogan, Mr. Merkel, Mr. Erdogan, consider Mr. Merkel, you know, you know, you know. she was, she, she uh, Mr. Merkel, oh yeah, 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 Mr. Erdogan. Yeah, oh, Herr Merkel, Herr Merkel, come, come, Mr. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <coughs> Poor Merkel, no, Mrs. Merkel, she wants only, and Mr. Sarkozy, which is. <laughs> Marine Le Pen said, this chancelier, this chancelier, uh, oui, uh, Marine Le Pen uh, said to, to, uh, to uh, Sarkozy, you are the vice chancelier, Mrs. Merkel. Horrible! <laughs> and Mrs. Merkel said, yes, he is. He's a yes, horse. Oh, oh, oh. you, you, do you think you say Mr. Uh, Mr. Hollande? The head of Mr. Hollande? You should speak to you. Poor man. So, important now. The three phenomena are Lincoln against our people, our common European people. Immigrationism, abortionism, for abortion. Yes, yes, of course. New laws in France. You have not the right now in France to, to give to the woman uh, information about the danger of abortion. No, this is good. Abortionism. And homosexualism. Really? Homosexualism. You don't need to be Mr. Einstein to understand that three phenomena, immigrationism, abortionism, and homosexualism, have the same roots and the same aims. Even it is often unconscious. Laws for abortion and for gay weddings in the whole Western world as exactly in the same anthropological process that the permission of immigration, they want to destroy the European white native ethnic strump by the two pincers of the crab, destroying the white birth rate by the gay homosexual and poor abortion policy and organizing the invasion of outside populations. These three phenomena, immigrationism, abortionism, and homosexualism, are the manifestation of a suicide. I mean ethnical global suicide. This is all. Other things important now, my dear friends. In conclusion, uh, what to do and at which uh, conditions? The problem is that we have uh, to change of mental way. We have to change uh, of uh, geopolitical pattern. We must understand that now, in this uh, probably tragic 21 century, we have to see the world according to ethno-political concepts and not with geopolitical concepts. 
It means that uh, a new ideology have to raise up. As Nietzsche said in this concept, umwertung, umwertung, which means changing of mentality. By stopping the uh, egoism and traditional opposition between white nations from European origin, like, for example, the, the war against uh, Russia and uh, Ukraine about uh, and uh, in the which comes in in Middle East in Middle East. Uh, all the people from European origin must think that uh, geopolitics is finished and that ethnopolitics is beginning. The future history for the first time there is a global danger for the white people on this planet. This is the aim of the geopolitics, and I want you to think to this new point. Uh, this point is, uh, of course, linked to, uh, I wrote about Islam, Islamization, real attack on Islam. Uh, Islam re-attack Europe, you know, uh, after the stopping of the 18th century and the 19th century. Islam is divided in three sources. Dar al Dar al means the domain and the time of the peace and the treaty. Dar al Harb in Arab means the beginning of the war. Dar al Islam means the beginning of the submission to Islam. We are actually on the edge of the between the Dar al Harb and the Dar al Islam. Uh, this is they are going to invade us, and of course we don't know us, and you don't. Uh, Interest, we are not uh, interested by this. So you must, and we must understand too that the, the ethnopolitics means aggressivity of third world, but too with Islam. We have two things, addic which which is in addition, you know, with aggressivity of third world after you know, uh, after you know, uh, colonization of France with Britain and so, and. Renew of Islam, we reattack always. I say in my book, Archaeofuturism, I want to say the future will be as the past. Islam reattack always, like in the 17th century, like in the 18th century, like in the 7th and, and, and 8th century. The, he reattacks Islam, reattacks, because Islam has a very long memory. We are no memory, you know, we are no memory. But, uh, well, it's up, uh, it's up something here. No, I mean, I'm not in some of like this, you know. So, and there is another thing, that Islam is a banner for third world. There is, and there is, and you must take conscience of this. We are not racist. Are you racist? No. They are all racist. I am not the right to be racist. In front, there is an association name, Le Cran, Comité Régional, Association Noir. Committee for the Black Association, if I found a committee for the, for the White Association, I'm in jail immediately. They are the right to be racist. We are not the right to be racist. They are the right to have the, the identity. We are not the right to have our own. Because we are coupable, we are, no, we are white. Oh, quel horror. What, what happens? It happens that. Ethnopolitics, remember this word, ethnopolitics. For the first time, the future war will be not this Islam, but globally, I'm sorry to say that to you, I'm sure it's true. The war, globally, between the European or American, I say this word, why? Not the word very scientific, but against the others. Planet Earth is entering as a novel written in 1924 in Australia. I don't remember his name. Planet Earth is entering is a third world war, which will be a racial ethnic war between globally the, the white and the others. By revenge, I think I'm sure of this. I'm sure of this. 
this will occur. In Europe, of course, it will be simple, but I think it will be something which occur. Carl Schmitt, German philosopher, and Julien Freud, which was a French philosopher, one of his friends, said, the enemy defines yourself. If you say, I have no enemy, the enemy say, I am your enemy. So it is the enemy who defines yourself. I am no enemy, the others are your enemy. You, you don't want the fight, you don't want the war, you will have the war. You say, I'm pacific, I'm for the peace, I'm for the concord, I'm for the accordance, I'm for the, the, the okay, if the others say, no, I want to make bomb, I am your enemy, he is your enemy, you make one the war. So the solution is to, and this is my conclusion, so it is, I say something like the French, uh, uh, Jean Raspail, which is the uh, author of uh, the Camps of the Saints, we, 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 in 73, described the invasion of Europe by people coming from the third world, submerging everything, you know. And he said it is finished, you know, it is finished. Life is in France, la République contre la nation, Republic contre la nation, we prefer the Republic, Republic, multiracial Republic, nation is finished. Or that said, Conrad Lorenz, Conrad Lorenz with the eth German ethologist, who said there is two solutions in the war. Even that in German, the Barm tot, Barm tot. The death, one, the one death, you know, the, 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 the death, you know. Other, the real struggle. We will have a, to, to make a real struggle. Not only intellectual, but physical. Because in the humanity, we are not only, we are not a female alien, there is not only brain, there is body. We shall have to fight. The problem is that what's taking is the dreams. The problem is children. How do you have children? Why children? This is important. In Kosovo, in the year 15, there was nine people Serbs against one people Kosovo Muslims three generations after. One people serve, nine people come to Kosovo Muslim. Why? Because each family, Muslim, has four children. Each family serve as one children. Three generations after, as we say in a French slang, c'est plié, it means finished. So, what is important in the history of humanity is to be able to make war. It is to be able to make children. It is to be able to defend its own value. Of course it is important. Of course it is important to have ideas and so. But I think that we can will because uh, the aggressivity of the invaders under the flag of Islam will perhaps be a wake for white nations, but it is not absolutely sure. I hope it will be possible. This is why I write books. This is why I want to speak. I'll say the uh, elderly German Poets that you know, predigen und sprechen, to predict and to, and to speak. And I said, as an old French proverb said, very old proverb, uh, I, I tried to translate in English. Nous vaincrons parce que nous sommes les plus forts. We shall win because we are the stronger. And I would conclude by saying, from resistance to reconquest, 
de la résistance à la reconquista. Merci de votre attention, j'attends les questions. Unfortunately, I will prefer to have more questions. The problem is not how a man has children. The problem is how a woman has children. Because as you know, as you remarked, I think, uh, those who uh, birth children as women, not men, uh, apart in the Air Force, uh, gay marriage, so maybe it's just stupid. No, no, I have, I have three children, but the problem is, uh, in demography, it's horrible because in front, you know, they say, why are you live in France? You know, you have all oh, the most performance in all Europe. You have two, two children, my woman, well, but in your Germany. The problem is that why France has more children than the other country of Europe? Because we have the more immigrants from Turkey and from uh, Arab countries, and from Africa countries, you know. And they have four children by women. Demography is the war, you know, demography. It is the same thing in Israel, for example. In Israel, you know, the Arabs in Israel, you have arms, you have planes, you have F-16, you have everything. We have le ventre de nos femmes. We have the, uh, we said the France in English, the, the ventre. Womb. Uh, yeah. The womb. The womb. The womb. The womb. Yeah. The womb. The womb of a woman, you know. You have rifles, you have M-16s, you have machines, the rainbow, rainbow. <laughs> the problem is, uh, who is, you know, hey, hey, oui. The problem is in Europe, you know, the problem is, ou alors, otherwise, like, like the Japanese, the Japanese, very good. Yeah, no children because they're older, you know, and they say, yes, but we prefer to be between us and no immigrants. And why no immigrants in Japan? Because there is not help. There is no pompe aspirante. There is no pompe aspirante, it means in French, you know, yes, by, by, by money, by, by, by children in schools and so on. No, no, nothing. You go in Japan, you are an uh, asylum seeker, you have a refugee, okay? You come, oh, you want to be to hospital? No, 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 in the street. In the street. <laughs> uh, my children, no, oh, no, no, no. Uh, I, I have a problem is, you know, is, uh, you want to help me? No. You have money? No. No, you did. What did you do? Yes, you know. And, you know, and of course, there is no migrants. So it is not necessary in Europe to have barriers. It's not necessary to have barriers. You know, you know the police of Machin, on a vu the Lord on film, là. in the film, the there is. No. If you have no help, if you have no help, don't come. Imagine one thing, terrible. In France, the refugee, asylum seeker, forced asylum seeker, he come, you know, he come. In Sweden, this is the same, I'm, I'm sure. He come in Germany too, exactly, exactly. Paris. He comes, he has more money, more help from the state of our countries than an old peasant's French, you know, in retreat. We, we have only 200 euros each month and the refugees has 1,000 euros each month. The scandal, the scandal. They prefer the stranger, they prefer the invaders. You know, it is a scandal, it is a scandal. It is really, I, I am, uh, you know, 
I don't want to speak about this more because uh, for me it's, you know, <laughs> it's a scandal. I was mad. My own, si my own sister, my own sister, she's in the southwest of France, you know. She has less money, less money, you know, than uh, the, 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 uh, the refugees from uh, I don't know where, you know. They come, you see, with two people, you know. You, you, they, they, uh, and the municipalities and, and the government, French, they, 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 they give up more money. It's incredible. It is preference étrangère, xenophilia, preference with strangers, suicide, ethnomasochist. And the problem is it's not only in France, it is in Belgium, in France, in, in England, less, in England, less, in Sweden. The problem with Sweden, I am in Sweden too. I say to you, you, Sweden, that your country, nine million of inhabitants, yes, you accept too much. If nothing changes, if you don't, don't want a revolution, Sweden uh, ethnically uh, will disappear. Uh, 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 it, it's mathematical, we disappear in two generations. Of, of course, you know, it, it, you must stop immediately. Sweden is in danger, Sweden is in danger, or oh, Sweden is a rich European country. The Swedish culture is very important. The Swedish industry is very important. Sweden is a very important country in our common nation. Because I think Sweden is not a nation, France is not a nation. We are common nations. From Siberia to uh, east of, the, uh, of Oregon, we are a common nation. We have some nations, Sweden, Swiss, Switzerland, you know, England, and so. But we are common nations. My message is very important: ethno politics. We are a common nations, and this is because we are a common enemy. Then we could take country that we have common nations. I'm stopped speaking because of okay. okay. Next. Simply the, the alliance between North America, Russia, and uh, uh, our uh, Europe, uh, uh, not uh, un European Union, Europe, is an aim, is an ideology, is an aim. It's not necessary to previous to, not necessary to, to say how all the things will, manage, will be managed. You know. The necessary thing is to give the idea. As said the uh, great Danish philosopher Kierkegaard, he said, important is ID, ID. To have ID of an alliance between ethno politics in each state that too. It's really North America, Europe, and of course Russia. Second thing, Putin. Yes, Putin is special man. You, you cannot, I, I, I'm, 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 I'm doing uh, each month, you know, uh, lessons in the uh, Le Mondosov University uh, at uh, Petersburg and, and uh, Moscow. Uh, you can exactly not think, that, in fact, the Russians too, they want to reinvent themselves in their own proudness. They want to be proud to be Russians. But I don't think they have a great vision at the long term of, geopoli of geopolitics and so on. My aim, my aim, my modest aim in only to influence the Russian university to, to, to today according to my ideas. And my ideas are what? My ideas are union, post-nationalist, post-nationalist, ethnicist between all the people from, I would say, European origin, from uh, Ireland to Poland, you know, from Portugal to Russia, from France to Sweden, you know. 
and North America too, North America and Canada too. Even I have letters from people from Argentina, Argentina and China, China. They are European people in the mentality. And we must understand why it's very important in the future century we take it. For the first time, from the Neolithics, we have a phenomena interesting, which is a, a complementary of the globalization. This is we are, and the sociologists say that. Everybody smells this, like a sort of a, mm, une odeur, une odeur. A global opposition, even it is not saying, but the thing which are not saying are the more important, a sort of opposition with traitors, you know, like a lord, you know, man, the woman that you don't dare to say. The white people and the others, something like this, you know. There is something like this, you can send some inner films, you can send this. Even the anti-racist methodology is terribly racist. The race is nowhere. Nowadays, aujourd'hui, 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 nowadays, but you know, nowadays, the race is the obsession of the anti-racist, of everybody, of all the humanities. Look at the pub in the, t in the TV, you know, it's incredible. Look at the, the Im immigration problem. Look at the films that we say. The film, have you seen the films? The violence of the blacks against the white immigrants, have you seen that? The problem of race, unfortunately, this is like this in the mondialization concept. Humanity is, will be the future problem. Europeans, native people, of course, of Europe, from Stockholm to Paris, you know, this is very close. Uh, you know, European native people, even in China, even in our wedding, again, the others, plus ou moins, more and more and more. But we street us in the two camps, of course, of course. But this is the destiny, I think, of future humanity of this century, the racial, ethnical, the word, you know the word race, ethnic, it's the same word. This is the most important thing, I think. We are not Sweden, we are not French, we are not uh, English. We are not. No, we shall be, we shall be obliged to be, because the others say, even a, a Muslim, he says, you are French, you are English, you are German. We are native European, that's all. Other question? And after I was. Uh, yes, Putin. Uh, pu uh, Putin, uh, you know, uh, uh, I knew her uh, in, incredi incredibly in the year 18. I met him. He was, uh, yeah, you know, I wrote a book at this time, and, uh, you know, a, a municipality of Petersburg. It was a communist regime at this time, you know. And I met this, put this petit bonhomme, this uh, little man, you know, which was a member of the KGB. <laughs> Uh, and he says, you, you, you visit your St. Petersburg, St. Petersburg. Uh, he says, St. Petersburg, no, Leningrad. I said, Leningrad, the Chui, Leningrad. No, he was there. Uh, Karasho, Karasho. He said, uh, in St. Petersburg, da, da, da. No, I speak a bit Russian. And, uh, you know, so after uh, I, I had a new, I was contacted by uh, the, uh, I was contacted by the embassy of the uh, Soviet Union because uh, in my blog, uh, I was for po police, external policy of Russia, so I, uh, I am now a, f a friend of the uh, French, uh, uh, the Russian ambassador of uh, Russia in uh, Paris, Mr. Alexander Orlov. And uh, of course, uh, I am okay with the Putin solution, but uh, the problem of Putin is a Russian nationalist. He has not all the cards in the aim. Russia is a, 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 a Putin has right. Putin is attacked because he's the only uh, European uh, leader to defend the uh, ethnical and uh, uh, nationalist uh, identity of, of, of Russia, of, of, its own pe of its own people. You know, so he is a scandal. Putin is a scandal. He's a fascist, Nazi, you know, by, uh, uh, for everything. 
So, but you know, the rich actually uh, know uh, now. Uh, I, I, I back absolutely the policy of Putin, which evolves with problems because Russia is a feeble country. Uh, you know, economically, it's a feeble country. Globally, uh, it, it, it's not the, the, the it's not the, the, the problem of, of this conference. But I could uh, make a conference. Uh, you, you have you, you have a need to 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 read my blog for this. But I could make a conference of two hours about about about, about Russia. Globally, I think that today we people of our ideas, people of our ideas, we have to back the policy of Russia with intelligence, not to be you know not to be uh, submitted to Russia. Of course, the Russian they they not want. When I went to go to uh, my conference in Moscow, they said to me, well, we know that you are for Mr. Putin, but, but please, you are French, you are not Russian. Don't say you are for Mr. Putin. Don't say you are against, you are yourself, you are French. So you have to say what you think. Not to. So I think I am for Mr. Putin on 80%, on 20%, I am not, uh, 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 of course, for Mr. Putin. So, but I think, our interest in the long term, we Europeans of the West, I mean, uh, we Europeans, we, we are, I think we are all the, all the same people, of course. Our interest is to have, you know, uh, is to have a, a, a close link, a close link to Russia. And I will add, and I stop it, something with the United States. For me, the United States is not an enemy. It is, uh, there is two concepts uh, in the science, in the policy sciences, enemy and adversary. Echtos inimicos in Greek. Enemy and adversary. United States are an adversary on the economical plan, for example, you know, and the adversary. But it is not an enemy. Uh, the, govern the American government is different from the American people. But at the long term, our interest is, of course, a link between three, you know, the, the tripod, tripod, North America, Europe, North, white North America, I mean, North America, Europe, and Russia. Otherwise, really overpassed by the invasion of the world and from Islam. This is our, the, the, the most terrible things I want to say to you, we are threatened, and the worst enemies are in our ranks. It is our oligarchy and political classes. Thank you very much. Thank you.